Put your hands up. Interpol storms into the metaverse Interpol's metaverse is up and running and has been designed to streamline communication between various units, along with providing an avenue to conduct education and training. News The International Criminal Police Organization, Interpol, is putting on its virtual reality headsets as it prepares to crack down on an expanding list of possible crimes in the metaverse. According to an October 20 announcement, Interpol has launched the first ever metaverse specifically designed for law enforcement worldwide, introducing it at the 90th Interpol General Assembly in New Delhi, already fully operational. Interpol outlined that a key driver behind its jump into the metaverse is due to bad actors already leveraging the tech to conduct crimes, while public adoption rates are likely to significantly increase over the next few years. Criminals are already starting to exploit the metaverse. The World Economic Forum has warned that social engineering scams, violent extremism and misinformation could be particular challenges, the announcement reads, adding that notably, people have already been put behind bars for their actions in the metaverse. Last month, a South Korean man was sentenced to four years in prison for sexually harassing children in the metaverse, and luring them to send lewd photos and videos. At the event in Delhi, Interpol also revealed plans to develop a division dedicated to cracking down on crypto crime. Interpol Secretary General Jorgen Stock highlighted the need for the specified unit, as many law enforcement agencies are not follow the URL for the full article. For more on this story, visit the news article link.